Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to do URL round 5 Bahrain. And there's a lot of incidents in this, and this video will start with one in qualifying. As you can see, Dragon Pro up ahead, he just completely brake checks me, gives me half a front wing, and look, he tries to take me out again. Then he gives me a 5 place grid penalty, which is not good, especially when we need to defend our 21 point lead in the championship. And that front wing damage kind of destroyed the rest of it. I decided to do a lap anyway, and here it is. And that front wing damage would have given me more downforce, and this wouldn't have happened. So I did end up crashing out in qualifying, unfortunately. But if I didn't get that grid penalty, I wouldn't have started in last place. And um, I wouldn't have... Uh, I wouldn't have crashed. I would have been able to qualify higher than this, but thanks to Dragon Pro not knowing how to drive, it's just great. People, even if his wheel did con disconnect, well, he needs to make sure it's connected, and if it was disconnected, put it back into AI mode, because he just destroyed someone's race. He's basically just destroyed someone's qualifying, who's in the lead of the championship, and funnily enough, he's the person in second place of the championship. He's the person behind me, so I don't know if that was intentional because he didn't get a good penalty. And uh, here we're just doing a strategy, looking to do the one stop today because we think that'll be the better option. And there's no formation lap. That's great. Some people went AFK. But anyway, five red lights for the Bahrain Grand Prix, and it's lights out, and away we go. And look, we've already got another warning for our Dragon Pro. We haven't even done anything. But anyway, going into turn one, everyone breaks really early and Puckle Knock turns into us and gives us damage. That is great. Stuart, you need to review that. He turned into me, he turned the wrong way into the corner, just to basically lose part of my front wing. So now we're overtaking Restored Panda, gain a few positions through that turn one. And there's Jump Warrior lagging a little bit there, and there's Carnage everywhere, there's Wing Flying, people ghosting through each other. This isn't ideal. And then we're going around this corner here, I don't know what it's called, but it's quite a tricky corner to get right, especially on the race start. And um, we do go for a dive bomb and puckle, and he gives us no room at all. That puckle needs sorting out, to be honest. And now, Groundsy's got past us, and that, that's not good. And now, we go for a dive bomb. <sighs> we get given more damage, but there wasn't really anywhere for us to go. Either, I, either to, ply, to plow into Groundsy, or to plow into puckle. So we're going to have to pit this lap. So this is going to be a bad race already, I know it. So we're, already, we're overtaking Je wait, is it Josh. Josh, there we go, it's Josh. We're overtaking Josh. And we're going to box this lap. I'm going to have to do a two-stop now instead of a one-stop, which is really good. Not. And there's Dragon Pro hitting us again. Don't know what he's doing. There's Sammy, I think he's spun out or something. We're defending from King's Gamers. Sammy almost wipes us off the circuit. I'm joking. It's a fair move from here. And we go three wide with half a front wing. I mean, I'm, not, I'm literally mean half. I literally mean no front wing at all. That's not very good going three wide into a corner with barely any front wing. But we do, we do survive in the end. We do survive. Uh, now we're on lap number seven, catching Josh. We're on the mediums. He's on the supers. So you can see there's a pace advantage between us two. As uh, yeah, I'm on the harder compound than he is. We got the DRS got into the rich mix, just want to make sure we clear him, because we need to fight our way up the field now for the net for the rest 20, the little, 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 last 20 laps, and we do clear him pretty well, he does try to have another go at us, but I think we're fine for now, Ooh, it's quite a close one there, as he comes back and he just completely hits us, that's another incident, I mean look how many incidents are in this, I might stop racing in this league because there's so many incidents, the lead of the championship, I can see why all my te all the other people fighting me, not doing very well, because there's already been 5 incidents in 8 laps, and now on the back of Josh again, going down the straight, he's given us a little bit of a tap, and yeah, we do not go for the move, but we get the better exit, because he, he ran wide around that corner a little bit. Well, he went wider than I did. I've got DRS from Rich Mix again, and he sort of squeezed me into the wall. It's not that bad. He's let me get through. And we've got another collision. Well, that's just great. And there's Mighty Dune coming out of the pits. And as we're going, like, three or four wide. This is such a close battle here now. This is the thing I like doing in League Race is battles. And Josh is down our inside. I have to leave him a little bit of space for the, the apex of that kink. But now we move... Oh no, we're still on this lap. I'm just... Oh, he goes for a dive bomb. I have to 
give him room, otherwise I don't want him to smash into the back of me again. And Best FIFA's going to have a look, and I backs off. Managed to stick it around the outside of Josh here. And I think we've got rid of him now. Oh, and that's FIFA doing a dive bomb. Luckily it wasn't dive bomb me. I didn't want to get punted off into Narnia like I did. Like Josh punted me into Narnia. So see that big black cloud in the distance? Will there be rain or is it just cloudy? It's never rain in Bahrain, is there? Oh no, look. Josh just tried to take FIFA out. and now he's crashing himself out. That's That's got to be another incident. You see, that's incident number six. And now we're catching Mighty Dylan here. And uh, get the rich mix. Got the DRS. Could we potentially gain another position? And we are catching him rapidly here. There's someone else coming out of the pits. We dive bomb him. And oh, sorry, Dylan, didn't leave you enough room there. But I'm going to give you room for the apex. And oh, he's gone. I, get, I don't know whether that was my fault. I did do a late dive bomb, but I was going to let him back through around the next few corners. But I think he got caught on the back of Echoes coming out that um, kink. But anyway, we're coming into the pits now. Um, lap number 20 to go on the super softs. Because, yeah, we need we do need to catch because we're going to come out the pits outside of the points. And I believe our teammate Moores Buckley is currently in first place. So... If we score no points and he's in first place, he's going to narrow the gap down from 21 points to 4 points, okay? And he's going to be back in the title, which isn't good. But now we're catching Jake here. We've got the pace on him now. We're on the softer compound. going to pop it into Rich Mix and potentially make a move. We're going to do what we did to Josh, but no, he almost crashes us into the wall. He almost does a Schumacher. And now we're going down the straight the other side. We've got past him completely here. And he's, um... Ooh. He's stuck around the outside somehow, and now he leaves us no room, so we rejoin the track and oh, he swiped us. And we're out of the Bahrain Grand Prix. That, that's great. We're out of the Bahrain Grand Prix. We're going to score no points. Well, my championship is gone then. You better sort out these incidents, URL, otherwise I'm quitting, okay?